So this is just a little experiment which you can try at home. Grab yourself some scales, grab your batteries and I shall tell you how to tell if your batteries are genuine or fake. So we shall start off with we'll start off with a top quality battery. This one here is 3000 milliamp hours, 3500 milliamp hours. Now if you put this on the scales, when it comes back on again, a good quality battery is going to weigh 43 grams and above. So you'd expect this one the quality of it to be quite high. So indeed that is a good quality battery that is 49 grams that battery actually cost me nearly 20 quid but it does last a hell of a long time in the pad so the next one this is the amps plus one this is again 3500 milliamp hours so you put this on the scales and you see from that it is a quality battery and obviously you buy quality and they do last. Uh, this is the one that came with the pad. This one's 3002 milliamp hours. So again on the scales you can see it's a quality battery at 45 grams. This one came with a night vision kit I got. Um, it's 3000 milliamp hours so again you'd expect this to be around about 45 43 to 45 going by the milliamp hours on it so 43 so that is actually a pretty good battery now this one I got this from my local garden center it's only 2000 milliamp hours I think it was three pounds something, three pounds sixty something like that. So it, at two thousand milliamp hours, put that one on the scales, and as you can see, forty three grams. So that is another pretty good genuine battery, even though it does say somewhere made in China, wherever it was. There we go. So now for the cheapy ones. This one here claims to be 4,200 milliamp hours. So again, you'd expect that to be round about, for the size of it, that should be knocking on 50 grams. So obviously put it on the scale, it's 43. So technically, that battery Although it says 4,200 milliamp hours is more than likely 2,000 milliamp hours. So it's just a marketing thing to, to get you to buy a better battery. Or bigger capacity battery I should say. This one claims to be 4,800 milliamp hours. So again you would expect that to be up around about 50 grams. So on the scales, as you can see, that's only 36 grams. So that is more than likely less than 2000 milliamp hours. Uh, this is the last one I'm going to show you. This claims to be, if they get in focus, claims to be 3800 milliamp hours. I know just by picking this up, the weight of it, it is so light. So, being 3,800 milliamp hours, again, you'd expect that to be somewhere between 45, 48 grams. So, as you can see, that's only 24 grams. The capacity of that battery, chances are, is probably only around about 1,000 milliamp hours. So the model of the story is don't buy anything over 3600 milliamp hours because 3600 milliamp hours is the biggest genuine uh, 18650 battery you can buy. Like I said, 
these ones are only three pounds so it's only 2000 milliamp hours and believe it or not that battery will outlast them three in the pad so grab yourself some scales weigh your batteries if they're not up around 43 to sort of a 50 grams then they're going to be fake batteries but obviously it goes by the capacity even though this is only 2000 milliamp hours it's still up around 43 grams so a little bit interesting I hope you find it interesting uh, on another side um, a fully charged 18650 battery will be around about uh, 4.15 volts so I have no idea what they are when they're flat <laughs> Thank you for watching.